there's two teachers in the league? Yeah. Oh, I hope I get it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep it a surprise for me because I'm really hoping I get it. <laughs> I'm probably. Not. All right. Ooh, Mrs. Barrow's class. If you're Mrs. Barrow's class, would you please stand? If you think that you all right, that you're getting the student of the week, why don't you go ahead and stay standing? Wow. Mm. All right, everybody, stand back up. That didn't work. If you have short hair and you're a guy, because there's a couple girls that have shorter hair. If you're a guy, stay standing. I'm not as good at this as Brother Anyways. You have to actually think. If your name starts with a J, stay standing. I think we only have one person. Jaden State, come on up! For being a hard worker. Good job, Jaden. Good job. Oh, come on, come on. Now look at me, now smile. <laughs> All right. This is the high school. High school, please stand. Oh, this. Sit down. No, sit. No, sit down. If you believe that you got student of the week this week, stand up. I'm really a lot, a lot nicer than they make me out to be. <laughs> All right, you can sit down, Xavier. It wasn't you. I'm sorry. I don't mean to hurt your feelings. But uh, how about this? He is a, I wrote this, he is a steadfast example of what a student should be. Thank you. Stand up if you feel like you fit that category. But then, yeah. <laughs> I guess I'll try. It is Alexander Hatchison. <laughs> I'm trying to do it all professional and I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> Ooh, Miss Subax class. Yes. This one, this one is for, stand up if you think this applies to you, for consistent academic excellence. Stand up if you think that applies to you. Stand up if everybody's pointing at you. <laughs> it is automated. Stand up if you're in Mrs. Haynes' class. This one is for being very helpful and having a great attitude. I had an exclamation point, so I have to be louder. Hmm. I would like to have Samantha Utter, please come up to the front. Now, Mrs. Pitcher's class, you have a 25% chance of getting student of the week. Unless you put Jeffrey in there, then you have a 20% yeah, chance. My bad. Jeff. I'm sorry, Jeff. Then you have a 20% chance. But today, I think the chances were at about 25. And <coughs> I would like you to stand up if you are a girl. Oh, man. I would like you to stand up if you are taller than Alinda. <laughs> yeah, you're not taller than me. Why is the letter looking back? She's like, wait, who's taller than me? <laughs> I would like you to stay standing if you have brown hair. Uh, uh, if you're wearing a jumper. <laughs> if you're wearing purple boots. Good job, Summer, for keeping a good attitude. She has a great attitude right now. Let's look at this smile. And then last but not least, Mrs. Guffey's class. How many of you how many of you think you got student of the week this week? Oh man, Anthony. Yeah. Alright, well one of you, one of you got student of the week. It was one of you. It was for working hard on seat work and nice handwriting on papers. Very important. Are you a little white? Please come forward.
Let's line them up. Let's do this. Just right there. Now look at Mrs. Parker and smile. Do good smiles. Not corny.